Let's get it, man. Getting that, getting that workout in. Practice makes perfect. Starting an update two right here, man. We're on a fitness campaign. And then start what you can do. Whatever it is in your limitations, man. That's all it takes. Do one lap, walk a lap. Do another lap, walk a lap. Lap one complete. It's all it takes, a light job. Nothing to it, but to do it, baby. Got the doctor out here. <laughs> get it. What techniques that you used to use, man, when you was wearing the uniform that helped you on things like this, like running dock? I would try that technique and lead him into the turn. I try that technique. I try to split the straight away. But then I realized none of that mattered. It really helped me with running with swimming. Okay. Reef, right now, I might look like I'm on the car, but I'm talking to you. You want Katie to my head. So let me ask you, Doc. If you didn't play sports, like the kids over here playing football, they've been prepared for something in life. Uh -huh. Structure, the will to win, and competition. All right. That's where mentorship and coaching comes in there. Yeah. But a lot of times people confuse us veterans is that we were studs throughout our life. Little League Baseball, High school football, then the army. All right. But talk to the people about you saying you didn't play organized sports, but you went and killed the army at the highest level. But what was it when you started out in boot camp that by you not playing sports that prepared you for the career path that you had lived? All right. So came from a generation where you couldn't just sit in the house and soak up AC. Your moms, dad, uncles always had you outside. There's always a race at some kind of competition, dodgeball, hide and go seek, fast as a man out. I did play sports, but I organized sports. Out in the street, football. Went to the stop sign, make a left at the dad going red car, button hook, pass it to you. Oh, I would go play some basketball, no rules, rough. Elbows no, overseas no. when you get to the ground. No doubt. But uh, what got me physically fit for the military was discipline. That's something that the parents gave me. Discipline. I was already pretty much physically fit from just being in the, in the yard, you know? They make me call it the yard. But uh, it's all in the mind. So when I got out there in the military and they threw obstacles in my way, I just saw a big playground, my yard. I made a king of my yard, no matter where you're from. Parents, whereas other tribes learned the discipline when they got the basic by the drill sergeants. And some of them drill sergeants broke them. But the people that grew up, quote unquote, broken in private homes, we flourished in the military. Because the military couldn't do worse than where we came from. And that's what I take from it. No matter where I go in life, nothing's worse than where I came from. Nothing. No doubt.